Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you a simple way to install AltStore on your iOS device, no computer needed. AltStore lets you sideload IPA files directly onto your iPhone or iPad, and the setup is easier than you might think. I'll walk you through every step to make sure nothing is missed. Make sure you watch all the way to the end so you catch all the key instructions. Let's dive in and get AltStore running on your device. Before we jump into the download, let's quickly go over a couple of settings to ensure everything runs as expected. First, open your device's settings, tap on General, then scroll to Background App Refresh, and make sure it's enabled, either on Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and mobile data. This helps the app function properly in the background. Next, go back and tap on Battery and confirm that Low Power Mode is turned off. That feature can interfere with app performance, so it's important it stays disabled. Once these quick checks are done, you're good to go. With that out of the way, let's move on to the actual download. Launch your browser and go to titanmods.com. It's a trusted site offering various optimized and modified tools. Use the search bar at the top to find Alt Store and select it from the available results. You'll land on a dedicated page with detailed info, stats, and user feedback. Hit the Download Now button to start the download process. The download typically takes just a few seconds. If it's your first time visiting the site, you'll need to complete a brief verification step. It's fast, easy, and doesn't cost anything. You'll be redirected to a short guide asking you to install a couple of free apps from the App Store or Google Play. Just follow the instructions shown on screen. Once the verification is successful, the app will begin installing automatically. For me, everything went smoothly. And as you can see, everything is now fully installed and running smoothly. That's all there is to it. If this guide proved helpful and everything works flawlessly, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more helpful content. If you run into any issues or have questions, drop a comment below and I'll do my best to assist you. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.